Oh man, a top secret PlayStation 5 game. Let's talk about it. Hope you guys had a Merry Christmas. Feliz Navidad. Merry Christmas to all and to all a great night. We have some dope, dope, dope news items for this video, including a top secret PlayStation game. When it rains, it pours for CD Projekt Red. PS5 restocks happening tomorrow and so much more in this epic video. But we're going to get started with... A hilarious trend on Christmas morning guess what was trending on Twitter on Christmas morning hashtag no PS5 no PS5 was trending on Twitter yesterday on Christmas and it's a sign of the times we know what's been going on ever since the PlayStation 5 launched scalpers and stock shortages have plagued both sony and consumers and it sounds like there were a lot of disappointed families boys and girls moms and dads cousins aunties uncles everybody trying to get a playstation 5 and sounds like some dudes didn't get what they wanted for christmas because of the shortages um, even though the console has broken launch sales records for the launch month, still in short supply, the demand is outpacing the supply, and as a result, that um, the the term "no PS5" was trending on Christmas morning, letting you know. And I tweeted out on Twitter. I was like, man. I almost feel bad that I have two PlayStation 5s. And I capitalized almost because, hey man, Elder Bird catches the worm. You gotta be on it, you gotta be on it. I'm gonna hit, hook dudes up who did not get a PlayStation 5 at the end of this video, stay tuned. But the next news item, I found this to be very, very interesting. Another company will be selling customizable playstate custom ps5 face plates and here is the challenge they are daring sony to try and sue them this time the company is d brands d brands they will be selling um ps5 custom plates soon and we all know what happened about a month ago. Another company um, tried to um, sell custom PlayStation 5 plates. I believe it was a, UK, a United Kingdom company, a UK company. And Sony sued them and forced them to shut down their operations. But check out D Brand's official statement, official announcement. They even threw in a shot at CD at Cyberpunk 2077. This is what they said, um, announcing their custom PS5 plates. As the title of this post suggests, we are now the global leaders in PS5 faceplates. Sue us, Sony. No lie, they said sue us, Sony. This project has been, they're trying so, they're double daring Sony. This project has been in the works since just before we told you not to buy PlayStation 5 skins. Spoiler alert, this is why we told you not to buy PlayStation 5 skins. After moving a few more chess pieces through our four dimensions, we added a new production line to our plastic injection molding facility and got to work. Yada, yada, yada. And so they're announcing their custom pl face plates, but the crazy thing is they are daring Sony to sue them. Here's their shot at C um, 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 Cyberpunk um, in their announcement. 
will be entering mass production on PS5 faceplates by year's end. However, we won't be accepting orders until we have stock at our Toronto headquarters ready to ship. If CD Projekt Red has taught us anything, it's that selling products before they're finished is a bad idea. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I might get a faceplate just for their boldness, for their bravado. And so D Brands, D Brands will be selling custom face um, PS5 plates. I have to wait and see on the quality of the design. I might cop one. Who knows, bro? Anything is possible. All right, here is the meat and the potatoes of this, of this video. I mean, we got more news after this, but... It's been discovered that um, so a Sony London studio is working on a big PlayStation 5 project with online multiplayer. Why do I have this kitty video um, um, Sony iPad PS3 trailer I'm playing? Because this studio in the past, they've been relegated to more of sony's pet projects pun intended side projects they did ipad back on the playstation 3 most recently this sie london studio has been big on vr virtual reality games for um playstation but it looks like they are going to be making a mainline hopefully a triple a game and it will have multiplayer check out the job listing for this top secret game they're working on all right the job listings are for a lead 3d character artist senior gameplay programmer and lead online programmer a lead online programmer the interesting part here this is coming from twistedvoxel.com is how they are mentioning triple a games as experience here for most of the positions and so not hopefully it's a triple a game they are working on a triple a playstation 5 game so time will tell time will tell to see what exactly they're working on but sony has a big and incredible 2021 lineup of game and so they're just going to continue to use their studios to pump out projects stay tuned my next video might be playstation 5 the big 2021 playstation 5 games you don't want to miss that one but it looks like this company sie london or not looks like they are working on a triple a game and they're hiring and they're looking for a lead on a lead online programmer a multiplayer online game can't wait can't wait to see what they have in the works all right next news item when it rains it pours for cyberpunk Bro, they are officially getting sued. CD Projekt Red has been hit with two class action lawsuits for misleading investors with Cyberpunk 2077. So it's officially happened. They are getting sued. All right, dudes. Those are all the news items for this video. I do want to let you guys know on my gaming channel, I did beat Demon Souls. I beat the game today. The next game I'll be playing is Sackboy. I also, but tonight I'll be on Call of Duty and 2K with any sponsors who want to run. But in the morning, morning streams will be Sackboy. Uh, that also has multiplayer. So if you're a sponsor and you have Sackboy in the PlayStation 5, let's play. All right, dudes. What do you guys think about everything we talked about in this video? Sound off in the comment section below. I, oh, real quick. Quick, quick, quick. Demon Souls hype score. I got to give the game since I beat the game. Let me give the game a hype score and these are the reviews Scores my review scores. Give me my money back y'all tripping. I ain't beast or hype and the game gets a hype Loved love love Demon Souls from beginning to end tough game you're gonna die over and over and over but if you stick with it learn some nuances to the game do some side quests to level up your character bruh game is delicious it's excellent and so shout out to blue point studio great game gets my highest recommendation 
um, um, for a PS5 game. All right, dudes, that's it for this video. What do you guys think about everything we talked about? Sound off in the comment section below. I want to know, but before you go, bro, click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All things gaming, bro. All right, we out. Peace. Right here was my outro right here. Bye bye. You still watching this video? That means you like me. You really like me. I gotta hook you up. That's right. I'm giving away a $60 digital code every month for your platform of choice. Xbox, Nintendo, or PlayStation. Two ways to enter. One, make sure you're subscribed to this fire right here on YouTube. Two, follow me on Twitter at Obi1Plays. And that's it. You're in for the giveaway. But wait, there's more. Do you want to join an awesome gaming Discord with prizes and tournaments? Do you want to get on my friend list and game with your boy? Become a sponsor. Three ways to join. One, subscribe on Twitch. If you have Twitch Prime, you can do it for free. Two, click the join button right here on YouTube and become a member. And the third way to join, patreon.com backslash Obi1Plays. You'll thank me later. Also, check out the swag, bro. Links are in the description. I'll see you later. Deuces.